Here's a great exercise that we can produce for eccentric uh, deceleration loading. More importantly, some concentric or extension power that we garner from our hips, our glutes, and our hamstrings in the context of running. And as we landmark our footprint and exchange our drive off that set of print, and then moving into our next shape, we are essentially running. In order to do that, we would need to go to a band feature, okay? With the set band, it's gonna emphasize retraction and uh, compression of the shoulder girdle, okay? In order to achieve that, we would need some type of a box that's elevated. You can use this pile box, for instance. I'm gonna create a bit of separation on this set band to encourage that set position. From there, I would hook my foot on this set box. And as I go to create my extension, the emphasis is, of course, shoulder blades down and back. I want to kind of point my toe inward towards my groin area. And as I extend through, I'll get full contraction, full extension. Once I'm here, I'm going to add a calf raise feature. Things to look out for, I don't want a lot of rotation when I'm posing my set extension. This footprint is going to be engaged with this knee slightly kicking outward and the big toe engaged on the ground prior to exchanging that calf raise and I want to gradually kick this out, get at least hip level or slightly higher with a little bit of a lower back extension, and then of course I'm doing my calf raise. This is a great exercise to again build eccentric deceleration, more importantly concentric extension of the glutes and hamstrings in the context of your footprint engaging your next sprint mechanic.